Sin is our recommended charting software. In this video, one of our liaisons will explain how to toggle your Ensign ribbon. When you get your uh, charts, you're, you're going to have the ribbon look like this. One of the first things that you'll want to do, I'm going to move my Epic pin up here. One of the first things you'll want to do is put that push pin in this position. If you don't, uh, you have it in the opposite position. As soon as you click outside of the ribbon, it will disappear. It will hide behind a chart. So right out of the gate, learn to use that because it will save you a lot of frustration and confusion over where in the heck did my ribbon go. Uh, the fact that you can toggle your ribbon to either this profile or another profile, which is skinnier, you simply come up to that same, uh, that, that very top part of the ribbon where it's blue right here, right click, go down to the bottom, and then up one where it says resize ribbon. That resize ribbon is a toggle switch. Click it and it just changes back and forth from one uh, one shape to the next, to the, the expanded shape uh, to the skinny shape. Now keep in mind when you have the skinny shape you have not lost anything. When you click on the main tab you get all of the same menu items. When you click on setup same thing. Everything is right there. You just can't see it at all times. Another thing is when you first get your uh, ensign ribbon, chances are it's going to be uh, an elongated ribbon and I need I need to toggle it back to this position to show you. Uh, I, I think for most people it, it's like this or even maybe even longer. Um, I, I would recommend you just make it a smaller footprint by coming to the right edge, click and drag it in, but don't don't hide these things. That will that will backfire. So make sure that you're leaving all of the options that are available when it's in its expanded position. If you'd like to sit in behind the scenes with the trading group, call 888-646-8787 or go to deltatradinggroup.com.